Luchador mask. Some ill-fitting, some fit like a glove, but uh, certainly a big night here at Chase Field every year. This is Luchador mask night at the ballpark. Padres and Diamondbacks, second and three over the weekend. And, B.B., it's a good look for Unisex, some. Unisex, as we've seen, if it's men and women. Uh, a little scary here at the ballpark tonight. Hopefully scary for the Padres. It's certainly an intimidating crowd here at Chase Field. I just can't quite imagine coming to the ballpark and putting <laughs> on a mask and then going into a hot tub. <laughs> Well, it's Luchadora night. Lucha Libre masks. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I'll be performing this offseason in Tijuana. <laughs> Eddie Ortega and Juan Avila are going to be uh, my managers. Uh, I'm going to put on the mask and go. Uh, yeah. Look, like they made their way into the truck, too. Oh, the Eagle <laughs> Empire. <laughs> you know, I talked to Juan Avila before the game, and he said, he told me, he goes, Lucha Libre. That's that's big in the culture down in Mexico. I mean, some superheroes down there. El Santo was the big superhero when he was growing up. Now, of all the people not to wear a mask, and with that beautiful face, cover that. Come on. <laughs> well, guys, I had to try it on. It's actually quite comfortable. Um, it's restricting me a little bit from my job, though. I don't know if you can if you can tell that, but <laughs> this is a great giveaway. <laughs> that's just not you, Laura. It's not my look, Dick. No, no. Oh. I'll retire it. <laughs> the rally luchador mask. <laughs> he's got his he's got the rally cap on while he's reading his D-backs insider. <laughs> 